Georgia Capitol Newsroom today is crossover day in the legislature. It is the final day for any proposed bill to move forward. Both the House of Representatives and the Senate have a series of bills set for votes. WSCV's Archis Ashardry has a closer look. State lawmakers debating on key issues like voting rights and casino gambling on crossover day. There are only 40 legislative days, so they're all advocating for the issue so that we can, you know, get them addressed and either move bills or stop bills by signing that. Lawmakers debated for more than an hour on the Senate Resolution 140, which would require a constitutional amendment for sports betting. Supporters say casino gambling and horse racing would generate revenue for the Hope Scholarship and create jobs in the Pete State. We are the number one state to do business nine years in a row now. Every industry every week is announcing moves to Georgia. We have created with our leadership in this state an environment that encourages business to be here. But opponents say sports betting could lead to addiction and crime. Despite the projected revenue, ultimately lawmakers did not approve this bill to clear the Senate. Here at the Capitol, we have a science and technology committee. They are trying to pay attention to a little more of what the future will bring us and help us get uh, maybe some of our older laws uh, relaxed a little so that we can bring greater technology into to our area, into our businesses, and allow for things to change. If a bill fails to get a majority vote, it will not stay alive for this session, but could come back for next year's legislative session. Approved bills after crossover day will swap houses and could be modified by the other chamber. Archit Sashadri, WSAV News 3 on your side. Other bills discussed on crossover day include Senate Bill 221 on voting rights, Senate Bill 140 on gender affirming care, and House Bill 231 on prosecutorial power.